Here they come. And they're off. A stud named Sue set of the track together with Power Beach. Look for the lead. The inside, it's Kid Cool. Around the first turn they go. And it's Moiseev with Power Beach by a length and a half. Renin trying to get position with a stud named Sue charging up after Power Beach. Kid Cool in third. That's Live or Die away fourth. The inside Jaguar Cam fifth. With Hope Springs Eternal, another two to Electric Yankee. Off stride goes Shady Rival. Shady Rival off stride. Affected there was Dynasty. And far back to Spin Doctor. The quarter, 27 and three down the back stretch. And a stud named Sue enjoys a two length lead over Power Beach. Then it's two to Kid Cool in third. Live or Die getting a rough first over trip. Hope Springs Eternal with the cover fifth. Jaguar Cam sixth, Electric Yankee about seven lengths off the lead in the outer flow seventh. Then two back to Dynasty and Spin Doctor. The half, 57 seconds. And a big time breather for a stud named Sue leads it three parts of a length. Live or die, attacks on the outside second. Then it's Power Beach in third. Hope Springs Eternal, gapping cover fourth. Kid Cool will try to shake loose from fifth. Jaguar Cam sixth. They go by three quarters. And a stud named Sue put to the test by Live or Die. Three quarters in 126 even. Three sixteenths to go, and they're on their way home. And George Brennan goes to work on a stud named Sue. But he's got Campbell breathing down his neck with Live or Die. Right behind those two is Power Beach in deep stretch. A stud named Sue has something left. And it's a stud named Sue, determined winner in the Wilson for George Brennan in 152 and 4. First number six, a stud named Sue. Second number two, A, live or die. Third number five, Power Beach.